335 pounds of pure athleticism. This is what would happen if Patrick Mahomes had the Jamarcus Russell diet, but was also as fast as Michael Vick. So EA dropped a William Perry quarterback card. William Perry is a legendary D tackle. His nickname was The Fridge because he's literally the size of a fridge. And in my head, I thought, oh, this is fun. It's going to be a gimmick card. You know, that might be kind of funny. And then I saw his stats. He is the fastest quarterback in the game with 94 speed. He has 96 throw power, the most throw power in the game. He has 91 short, 90 mid, and 90 deep accuracy. He has 95 throw under pressure. He has 95 throw on the run. He has 97 play action. And if that wasn't enough, he has 94 strength. He has 93 jump. I don't even know if William Perry can actually jump, like in real life. I don't know if he could get both feet off the ground at the same time. Also, a huge thank you to my money back hack, Upside, for sponsoring today's video. Upside is an incredible app for anyone who buys gas, groceries, or dines out. With Upside, I get cash back on every purchase. It's my secret weapon for staying on track with my savings goals. To get started, all you gotta do is download the Upside app with the link in the top of the description. You can use my promo code MATTHEWM and you'll get an extra 25 cents back for every gallon on your first tank of gas. Now, once you open the Upside app, you'll claim an offer for whatever you're buying. For example, near me is a gas station that's offering a discounted rate on the Upside app. Then I go to the gas station, I pay as usual with my credit or debit card, I follow the steps in the app, and I get paid. You can cash out at any time to your bank account. They even have PayPal e-gift cards. It is so easy to use the app. So if you're not using the Upside app right now and you buy gas, groceries, or dine out, you are literally leaving money on the table. Make sure to check it out with that link in the top of the description and enjoy the rest of the video. Undoubtedly, this is my favorite card in the game right now, but they didn't even stop there. He has unique special X factors and crazy good discounted abilities. Your two unique X factors are either Escape Artist or Truz. You get either of them for 10 plays straight, and after those 10 plays, it deactivates, and you could activate it again, although it's pretty difficult. Truz makes it so you can't fumble. Escape Artist gives you improved scrambling speed when leaving the pocket. Truz is nice, but Escape Artist is a lot more fun, so I'm gonna be running Escape Artist. You could get Hot Route Master if you wanted to use him as a true quarterback, but honestly, my goal today is to go crazy like Michael Vick, except the 335 pound edition, so I won't be using Hot Route Master. He has three discounted abilities. You could either run Fast Break, Human Joystick, or Evasive. All three are hilarious. I'm gonna run Fast Break because I plan to run a lot of designed QB runs. I'm gonna be using the Ravens playbook, which is obviously catered to Lamar Jackson. A funny idea I've used before is Leapfrog, which prevents fumbles while hurdling. So if you're out in the open field, you can just hurdle and never fumble. Instead of this though, I'm gonna run Bulldozer for more powerful truck animations. If you successfully get the truck animation, you're not gonna fumble. So I just wanna run through people. And then Gunslinger, he actually gets for free. So he's guaranteed to have an incredible quarterback ability for zero cost. All of that in total is four AP, so we still have AP to use elsewhere on this team. There are strategy items specifically for zero chill players that give you a lot of really good boosts. The chill out strategy item gives you plus one speed and plus two strength amongst a lot of other things, but those are the only ones that we can use. So if you were wondering, the six foot two, 335 pound William Perry has the exact same speed as Tyreek Hill. Yep. Madden 24 Ultimate Team. We've got an all 90 overall offensive line. I put Lynchpin on Corey Lindsley for better blocking. I've got Tony Gonzalez, Tyreek Hill, Jordan Addison, and Mac Hollins to throw to. Keaton Mitchell's in the backfield with me. And defensively, we have the middle linebacker, Rob Gronkowski. So no matter whether we're on offense or defense, we'll have some really fun cards to use. Ravens offense, Chiefs defense. We might even see a little bit of triple option today. My new favorite offense. We're gonna hop into a Mutt Champions game so we get five minute quarters. Let's have some fun, boys. William Perry, Rob Gronkowski, Jordan Addison. What do we got, baby? Buckner Watt Sherman. All right. Now, with all videos like this, I like to try and break a record. And the record for the most rushing yards in a single game by a quarterback is held by Colin Kaepernick. He rushed for 181 yards in 2013. So my goal today is to beat that. We take this drive over at the eight. I've got a skate artist activated. Might have to start out with a throw. That's a beauty. 
Nice ball, William Perry. One for one, 26 yards. I can't start out just running because as soon as he puts on all those QB spies, I'm going to be in trouble. So I have to like, I got to bait him. I got to bait him into thinking I'm passing, I'm passing, and then we'll break a big one. That or, of course, we just run triple option like an absolute psychopath. Here we go. Irv Smith Jr. is the middle handoff key. Pitch it. Beautiful pitch. Keaton Mitchell. I love triple option. Just going to hand this one off. Ooh, nice cutback by Keaton to make that a first down. Going to go back to a pass. Right over the top. Tony G's. Ooh. i am be honest. I don't really know what happened there. Second and 10. He does not guard A. You got to guard that. First and 10. William Perry. Nice dot. Put a little wheel route on Keaton Mitchell here just in case that free forms there. Doesn't look like it's going to be, but the step up up the middle. I got to truck him. No, William Perry. No. Maybe I should have gone with Leapfrog and just hurdled right there. Or I could have gone with Truz and but unable to fumble. That's a bummer. Tough start. Second and six. He's got his halfback, sort of. Third and six, good defense. Maybe we get a stop here. I'm gonna send a hot blitz here. Let's see if his hatback has a route. No, he's blocking. Gronk up the middle. I got him. Almost picked it. Fourth and six from the 20. All right, here we go. Dropping everybody into coverage. Guessing pass. Fourth and six. Huge play. I see over the middle. I see the dig. I see the deep dig. No. Nice work. Nice conversion. Kind of expect a handoff now. I'm good. Oh, I missed an avalanche. That's a bummer. Missed an avalanche. Can't be missing those. Second and one. Oh, bad ball. Really bad ball. Justin Reed, great man coverage. All right. We got another option on offense here, baby. I still got escape artist. Go ahead, Bruh. William Perry. Just kidding. I'm predetermining. I can't predetermine something like that. You know, it's just got to happen. Easy check down. There's Keaton Mitchell wide open. Don't get the juke there. I'm going to Tyreek. Nice catch, Tyreek. Oh, was that dropped? Notice how that ball kind of like completely fell out of his hands. Whatever. Gonna go play action here. Let this set up. Oh, are we fast enough? No. Hey, we evaded for a good amount of time there. I'm gonna go QB blast here. Second and 10. Take me home. Or Aaron Donald could blow the whole play up. Third and nine. Big conversion. I got underneath Tony G. It's going to make it a more manageable fourth down. I just want to do something so stupid here. I Guys, I don't care if this works or not. I'm running fucking triple option. And I'm not giving it to Irv Smith. I'm getting out in the open. Give it. Pitch it. Pitch hey, it. Yo, fucking the, pitch what? it. Just throw it. Oh, my God. I said I don't care. Clearly, I care. Dude, that's so free if you just pitch it. I'm so sad, bro. I had this beautiful triple option play all chalked up in my head. Mm, second and 10. Faking this blitz here. Ooh, that one was a nice throw. I didn't think he'd have that. First and 10. It's going to go with the handoff, Avalanche! Unlucky spot to do it because we can't fall right back on it. But damn, that was a big hit. I think we have... One more play with Avalanche? Yeah, we have one more play with Avalanche. I have a feeling he won't do that again. Get there! Dude, he really wants those, and they're just not open. Winfield's still up. Wait just a minute, Winfield. Antoine Winfield, very nice play right there. Try and tell me not to run triple option. See how that goes for you, bud. So, that's interesting. When I run triple option to the left, it lets me pitch it. But if I run it to the right, it won't let me pitch it. At least it won't let me pitch it quickly. You know? I think Bobo can just run a fucking hitch and be fine. Interesting. All right, third and ten. We're really struggling right now. Just gonna take whatever I can get. Nice move! Oh my god, that move was so sick. Deja vu, gentlemen. Fourth and four. Do I run this to Tyreek? What the fuck even is this play? Because as much as I'd love to be a dumb idiot, I'm not running that. Okay. Gotta go to A. Great ball! <laughs> very, dude, that's off the like opposite side. That's a very difficult throw for a right-handed quarterback. But it's an easy throw for William Perry. I might freeform to X here. The feds can't stop me. Yep, the feds can't stop me. 
Second and 10. Everybody is boxed. Give one to Addison. He catches a nice contested catch, but damn, that was some good defense. What do we got? Third and eight. Fourth and eight. I don't want a field goal. Field goal is beta shit. I'm going for it. I don't care if not a single point is scored today. Let's get the decoy Tony G moving over here, yeah? Just make him think I'm going to Tony G. No! Stop it! TJ Watt is fucking deleting my O-line. Oh. This is the battle of mid. This is a mid off. Who is going to be more mid? Dude. I'm not running this in. I'm leaving it for William Perry, but me and you are having a mid off right now, and I think I'm winning. Or no, you're winning because you're more mid than me. Gun Heavy Raven, QB Blast. Go, Bruh. William! I'm gonna call a bunch of fake audibles. I'm gonna get him thinking this is a pass. Or maybe just same thing other side. Fuck it. Let's go, William! <laughs> Let's go! God, I suck. Maybe that's all we needed to get our, our mojo back. You know what I mean? I was wrong. I hate how bad offensive linemen are in men. They're just so stupid. They're all morons. Nobody knows how to properly double team. Oh, he dropped that, did he? Oh, no. Guys, I'm just goofing around at this point. But you know what? William Perry has now been in the end zone one time, and I, I plan to keep that up. I plan to do it another time. It's hard to get him any yards right now, though, with the way his D-line is playing. I'll be blocking five against three, and I can't even get out of the pocket. Ooh, nice ball. RPO? Is this an RPO? No. Nice ball. Damn, that was unlucky. He's up to the two now. I'm run committing middle. That was a good call, Matthew. Let's get it, baby. Second and goal from the three. Pushed him back a yard. What's he going to try here? How's he going to get in the end zone? He hasn't done it yet. I kind of expect him to do the same thing. It's an RPO this time, but it's bottled! Martin Emerson! Absolutely blew that up. I'm calling a timeout. I'm not letting you chew the clock. You're gonna- you gotta earn this, Tuddy. Does he do another RPO? I wouldn't be shocked if he did another RPO. This does not look like an RPO to me. If it is, I just don't know which one it is. It is an RPO. Of course it is. Madden 24! Madden 24! It's honestly a miracle that I stopped his RPO the first time. You know how hard it is to stop these RPOs, bro? He gave me too much clock. He gave William Perry way too much clock, though. 37 seconds against the GOAT. Good luck, bud. Maybe I'll just beam Jordan Addison for a bazillion yards. I'm gonna go Keaton Mitchell out the backfield here. That went virtually nowhere. I gotta burn our time out a little early. And by a little early, I mean super fucking early. I don't know what I want to do here. Ooh. But I really like that. He's trying to cut me off, but nice route, Tony G. Can we do a little more of that? Damn. Damn. I wasn't even like, I couldn't have even caught that. Damn, he's going to score too. He's just gearing for a field goal. Calls a timeout there. I don't actually know what he's doing. 59 yard field goal? I feel like that's pretty doable. I don't see why he can't. No, you did not just catch that. Alrighty. I guess it's my fault through a stupid ball. He should onside kick this. I'm determined to get an onside kick today. Do you believe? Travis Kelsey does not. He will not allow it. Interesting pass decision, Michael Vick. You know what's crazy? That's Michael Vick's fourth interception, and I have six points. There's something so criminal about sitting in the pocket and throwing with William Perry quarterback, you know? Like, yeah, you could you could pick up the yards, and you could score the touchdowns, but it's just... It's not the way he was meant to be used. That's all there is to it. But at the same time, I want to win the game. So let's do what we can to win this game. 
Okay. Go! Get it! You know, I dive like an idiot like that a lot, but I don't fumble that much. I think William Perry might specifically be fumble prone. Like maybe to tone down his crazy stats. Hey, I like what you're doing. See, like right there, like I would have fumbled that ball. I respect him for showing love to the playbook though. Nice pass, nice catch, third and three. Who will win the battle of mid? Oh, no way. That is blanketed. Is this a run play? Oh yeah, we, we made the, dude. I actually blitzed the safety and the corner on that side. And he got eight yards. Hello. The play action now? No, same thing. There's Gronk! What a hit! How many fumbles have there been in this game? This might be a record for the amount of fumbles I've ever personally seen in a game. I think we're sitting at six, six fumbles. All right, Reek, I'll give you one, buddy. Calculated, this game is easy. That was the freest throw of my life. Keaton Mitchell, calculated free, easiest throw of my life. I'm scared to go in the open field. God, that was that was so unbelievably close to his user. That's disgusting. Might try and go Addison for the tutty here if he's there. Oh, Addison's got him. Addison's got him! But he's not in! First and goal! I need to play. I need gun heavy Raven. He thinks I'm doing it. Dude, I hate when they Go William! Go William! Dude, stop! He just he just fumbled it through his end zone! That's a touchback! This guy's a bum! He's actually the most fumble-prone card I've ever used in my whole life. That is not an exaggeration, bro. I've used so many quarterbacks. I've ran like an idiot with so many quarterbacks. Nobody has ever fumbled seven times in a game. Or five times in a game. Oh my god! I guess it makes sense. Like, he probably shouldn't be good at running the ball. I'm just so sad. Ooh, nice route. Little escape route there. Boom! Michael Vick has four interceptions. They fumbled twice. I have one interception. I fumbled five times. It's six to ten. That was criminal, though. We are right there. I think he even stuck the ball out. And he fumbled it through the back of their end zone. Oh, nice hit. We're hitting hard, though. We're hitting hard. Oh, my God, boys. Well, okay, so if he gets a field goal, he's up by seven. So the game is still truly winnable. That would have been such a nasty play. Dude, I gotta watch that bag. Maybe the refs got it wrong. Maybe that was a touchdown, dude. I think this is a stretch run. No, play action. I just pulled Justin Reed out, which is bad. I kind of need him on this play. Probably actually a run. Actually, no, tight end attack, maybe? What do we think here? Oh, no, actually a run. Nice defense. We're all over that. Second and 10. Just gotta keep him out the end zone. We keep him out the end zone, we're doing just fine. Play action. Yes. I have this so bottled. Third and 10, good to do it. We just hold him to the field goal. We get William Perry down there. We score, we go for two, we win the ball game. That's the plan of attack, I'd say. I just got a fucking encroachment. And I stopped him. That hurts. Third and five. RPO handoff, pain. If he really wanted to, he could just run RPO every play and he'd score all the time. That's how this game works. I don't really know what this is. Could be an RPO. Do it, do it, do it, do it. Throw something, throw something diabolical. Second and goal from the nine. That was good defense. If he runs the ball is what I'm worried about. Second and goal, boys. Okay. Great defense intercepted by Will Anderson. You bet your sweet ass I am not running this in. This will be a William Perry touchdown. Get out. It's a battle of mid. Who will win? If you don't like the battle of mid, then you don't like football. Oh. William Perry can't even fucking QB sneak. You can't tush push? Wait, are you serious? You're the fattest piece of shit I've ever seen in this game, and you can't tush push. Oh my god, you're actually lying. You, There's no way. He's not even in goal line. He has two D linemen and Josh fuck... Oh, that's Ted Hendricks, I think. What? 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 Wait, you're telling me that wasn't it? It is a touchdown there, but this is this might actually be the most the shittiest quarterback I've ever used. As much as I love him, as much as I want this to be good, this is so dog shit.
I'm going raving heavy, baby. That was so bagged. No, no, you have to tackle him. Oh! Yeah, that wasn't open at all. He saw my audible. I'm still going for a speed onside. I said I wanted an onside kick. I'm gonna get it. I said I'd do it, so I'm gonna do it. Oh, that was a dog shit kick. Nice football IQ, gentlemen. Just slapping that ball after seven yards. All right, first and 10. He's across the 38. He's in field goal range. How does he play this? That's fine. Go ahead and get all those yards. That, that inhibits your ability to chew the clock. I'm going to bring Justin Reed down for this run. Oh, he's not running. Oh, no, he is. Great defense. I'm going to bring Justin Reed down again. Play action. Oh, that was actually a run. He's got to get a first down. I'm about to just blitz Gronk and just see what happens. Oh, I'm right on him. Oh, I almost sacked him. But dude, that's actually pretty good because it, it stops the clock. Fourth and eight. Now he's got to kick his field goal right now. Oh, that was that was risky as all hell, but it worked. Fourth and eight. Wait, is he faking it? Okay. All right. So he goes up by one. Now it's just up to William Perry to take me to the promised land. Two timeouts to salvation, really. I'm going to take the easy one here to Tony G. Tried to juke around Hendricks. Don't get it, but still, that was nice. Can just go no huddle here. Run the same thing. Although I might be able to hit Tyree Kill up a seam. Does he switch to Willis? Yes, he does. That's fine. He adjusted, so Keaton Mitchell's now open. Out of bounds after seven. Beautiful. You know what's funny? Like, his passing stats are actually quite impressive. He's got a good completion percentage, a lot of yards, no touchdowns, and then one interception. It's not anything special, but it's, you know. He ain't playing poorly. Tyreek. Damn, that was really good defense. I think that was Sherman. Yeah, that Sherman's lethal. Playmaker on B. Chucking it up. Oh, what was that knockout? He had it and then the ball went over his head. Oh, that was Bogue. He totally had it. All right, fourth and three. Biggest play of the game. Right in the middle is Keaton Mitchell. <laughs> fourth and three. And wait, we're in field goal range. Right? We're in field goal range. Oh, my God. Did we just win the ball game? Coach adjustments. Wait, that was actually the biggest play of the game. All right. Naturally, we have to go fullback dive here. He does have three timeouts, though. So, actually, if I really want to win the game, I got to get a first down. If Irv Smith's fullback dive wants to go for a first down, I wouldn't. There's second and eight. Low key. What if I, like, what if I just, like, sat in the pocket for, like, eternity and just ate up clock like that? Is that even possible for me? William. William! William! He ends the game! Why is Coach not telling me to go to a field goal? He calls the timeout. Oh my god, William Perry. <laughs> Say whatever you want. He just ended the ball game. Alright, we just need to kneel this ball. Just gotta milk out every second o'clock that we can. He'll call a timeout. That is fine. I will just do one more kneel and then he actually can't ice me now. So once I once I kneel this, I can take it to two seconds. Three, two, call my own timeout, and now he can't ice me. Now we just come out. Bury the field goal with Butker, 35 yards for the ball game. What if I shank this, though? Wait, why is it iced? Whoa, that's fast. Whoa, that's fast. Still got it, and I think he fucking roughed the kicker. Dude, what if I missed, though? What if I missed and he roughed the kicker? Decline ball game! Let it be known in history today, January 2nd of 2024, the Battle of Mid was conducted where the Atlanta Falcons beat the Buffalo Bills 15 to 13 in the greatest Battle of Mid. Loki, if I had put Truss on, I would have won by, I think, third. Uh, William Perry still outperformed Michael Vick. 84.6, 21 for 29, 72% completion and interception. He had five interceptions. 15 for 26 on the ground, a fucking horrible stat line, but he did have two touchdowns. Three fumbles is hilarious. You literally had five. They didn't even count multiple of his fumbles for some reason. And I need to watch the one where he fumbled through the fucking back of his end zone. 
First and goal, negative 79-yard rush by William Perry. Yeah, this is the one. All right, boys, play the game. Play the century right here. So he uh, he run commits, which is hilarious because despite him run committing, he still bagged every single route. Other than maybe Tyree Kill, but I don't know. Maybe that corner jumps up like a Wii character and just bags it. So we decide to scramble around the edge like an absolute psychopath. I feel like I have the edge here. And we're going to find out. We're going to find out right now. He's reaching. He's reaching. God, you're such a bum. Dude, just keep reaching. How did it fall out of your hands? Yeah, dude, he so easily could have just stuck that out there. I didn't throw the ball. What are you doing? That is such... That's an all-time bummer, dude. GG's to my opponent, the Battle of Mid. We are victorious. William Perry, quarterback. Hilarious on paper. I mean, listen, though. Like, if you use him with Hot Route Master and Gunslinger, it's probably a totally different story, and you just sit in the pocket, and every once in a while you scramble. But, um, wow, that was the most fumble-prone quarterback I've ever used. Or maybe it was just a, an unlucky game. I don't know. But I had a good time. I had a fun time. That's what mattered. All right, guys. I love y'all. Thanks for watching. As always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.